showcase winning website and click on their link. Amy, thank you so much for sitting and talking with me, but also while we're here in Toronto, thank you for doing my hair every day. My pleasure, it's been an absolute blast. Amy, can you please give me a little background on how long you've been doing hair? Sure, I started hairstyling about over 20 years in Australia, and about 10 years ago I started specializing in bridal hairstyling with our world-renowned stylist Sharon Blaine. Now 10, 20 years, do you think it's important that you keep up your education? Definitely. Uh, these days trends are changing so, so quickly. Our brides are coming to us with Pinterest boards, Instagram pictures, and they want you to be able to recreate these looks for them. So going into education, you're able to keep up with those trends? Yeah, every year I, I spend time either in Australia or going to America and I educate myself with the best artists that are available in our industry. So what trends have you been seeing coming up in this season? I'm finding the trends are really extreme from high glam to uh, really natural minim minimalist and of course the, the classic hair that we recently saw Meghan Markle wear. She's definitely going to start a trend, isn't she? For sure, and I mean that's such timeless hair, so I'm all on board for that trend. What would you say is one of the styles that you really enjoy creating? For me, it's all about the updo. Updos are long-lasting for weddings. You don't have to worry about them once they're being created. And also, uh, the updos that we're seeing at the moment can be so soft and romantic, so they can really be adjusted to suit any bride's style. So as you said, you specialize in hair. Why do you think it's important to have a professional for your big day? Uh, there's so many reasons. Uh, one that comes to mind is the timeline. Uh, we're the first to arrive on the morning of the wedding and you want to be ready on time. If we don't get you out on time, then your whole day runs away on you. And also recreating the look from a trial to on the, on the day. Having a specialist, they're going to be able to recreate that look consistently as well for you. How long is usually a trial with your brides? Uh, we allow two hours. And on the day of, how long do you spend with a bride? An hour and 15 minutes. So you need to have that time to prep, get it ready, polish. Yeah, definitely. How would you say that preparing a bride for her day is different than the other events that you do? There's a lot more communication for most of our brides. It's the first time that they're getting married. So we need to educate them, prepare them, and you know, um, hold their hand through the experience as well. And that can sometimes be up to a year in, in advance. Do you end up making connections with them? Oh, definitely, definitely. And where can people see other photos of your beautiful work? On Bridal Hair Collective, we, our Instagram page, we're constantly updating that. And Instagram stories, you can see all the behind the scenes of our bride's special days. Amy, how would you describe the look that you gave me today? Soft glam, we added some hair extensions for volume and for long lasting. It looks good, it feels good.